Welcome everyone to the Roll to Roll News. I'm your host as always, Kevin Lifsey. A quick reminder for the upcoming ARC Summit beginning on April 23rd with a focus on renewable energy and sustainability. This exciting event hosted in Golden, Colorado will feature market level presentations, panel discussions, and the ARC annual meeting. Additionally, we will host multiple opportunities to network with other attendees and a facility tour of the National Renewable Energy Laboratory. Registration is open at RollToRoll.org and registering early ensures you get the best price possible. Jumping into today's headlines, Pepsi unleashes its new look. Pepsi steps into a dynamic new era with a new look and exciting culture first experiences across sports and music. Pepsi's new look takes flight worldwide, taking over iconic global locations as its first major global redesign in 14 years was unleashed across over 120 markets. To mark the moment, digital installations, each featuring the redesigned and refreshed Pepsi Globe logo rose above landmarks worldwide for a digital showcase of Pepsi's new visual identity in a blaze of pulsing electric blue and black, carrying the brand into its new era. The new logo thoughtfully borrows equity from Pepsi's past whilst incorporating modern elements to create a look that is unapologetically current and undeniably Pepsi. CCL opens a sustainable sleeve label converting hub. Toronto-based CCL Industries officially opened its new sustainable sleeve label converting hub in Austria today, completing the move from its former site. The new facility represents a 50 million euro investment and more than doubles the size of the previous site. Nearly 10,000 square meters are dedicated to the production and a fully automated warehouse, including intelligent computer-controlled software to optimize storage space management and automate intra-logistics. The move brings a lot of improvements. Not only is the building state-of-the-art and provides a modern workplace for our employees, but the technology is also state-of-the-art. The building has been designed according to modern sustainability aspects and with the long-term goal of further reducing our carbon footprint in production, says a member of the CCL management team. ProAmpac collaborates with Aptar CSP Technologies. ProAmpac announces the launch of ProActive Intelligence Moisture Protect MP1000, a patent-pending breakthrough moisture absorber technology that eliminates the need for desiccant packets. MP1000 platforms use Aptar's CSP Technologies three-phase active polymer platform technology to lower the moisture level in the packaging headspace, making it ideal for applications that require optimal moisture control such as point-of-care diagnostic kits, live culture probiotics, and hydroscopic powdery food products. We are excited to launch the Moisture Protect MP1000 platforms, the newest addition to the ProAptar intelligence product line. This innovative product has a high moisture absorbing capacity and is set to revolutionize moisture protection in flexible packaging. Our extensive material science work and exclusive collaboration with Aptar CSP Technologies has enabled us to bring the latest active packaging products to the market, says Senior Vice President of Global Product Development and Innovation for Pro Impact. Michaelman is set to showcase its next generation digital print primers. Michaelman will exhibit at D-Scoop Edge Indianapolis where they will showcase their full portfolio of water-based coatings for HP Indigo Digital Presses and participate in two educational sessions exploring how to balance performance and sustainability in digitally printed labels and packaging applications. D-Scoop attendees will be introduced to DigiPrime Vision, a groundbreaking new line of primers. Designed specifically for the inline priming units of HP Indigo Digital Presses, including the new HP Indigo V12 digital press, these primers help facilitate moving more analog jobs to digital, reducing media waste and overstocking. DigiPrime Vision 9000, the new inline primer for the HP Indigo 6K and 8K digital presses, provides the highest possible print quality on the broadcast range of substrates of any digital print primer, from smooth vinyl to heavily textured papers, as well as niche materials such as twill, wood veneer, and velvet. Before we end today, just a quick reminder of two educational opportunities on April 17th in Green Bay. Ted Lightfoot will be presenting his Converting School course, Introduction to the Coding Process, while David Roysom will be presenting Essentials of Web Handling. Learn more and register on our education page at RollToRoll.org. Finally, we have roll to roll USA and roll to roll Europe coming later this year. roll to roll USA will be held in Charlotte, North Carolina from September 24th through 26th. If you'd like to present at one or both of these conferences, our Call for Papers is available, and we are currently taking submissions in the areas of coding and laminating, 
vacuum web coating, web handling, printing, flexible packaging, battery manufacturing, flexible electronics, and sustainability. Learn more and register on our events page at RollToRoll.org. Thank you all so much for watching this edition of the Roll2Roll News. I'll see you next time.